Doesn't look like the Price family is rolling in dough these days. Now this is the Chloe I remember. Always smiling and laughing. Not so much anymore. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. He told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered. Told you to stay away from that place. It's dangerous. And you got no idea what kind of scum are living out there. Stay away. I'm serious. I love that they have the same old answering machine. And there's a message. I'd love to go to Paris, too. At this rate, they'll be lucky to get to Portland. Joy still works at Two Wells Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Yum, that looks tasty. I do miss Joyce's cooking. Brr, I can feel autumn pushing out the summer. Hey, I remember that stain. Chloe and I knocked over Joyce's wine bottle and we scrubbed forever, but it never came out. We got so busted. Come on, open it, chicken. Hold on, and I'm not chicken. Prove it. You drink first, Max. No way. It was your idea, Chloe. Whatever. Give me that bottle. Well, tasty, very tasty. Here, I, I want a sip. Sorry, this is not for kids. Don't be greedy, give me some. Oh shit, the carpet. There's wine all over. What do we do now? My parents are coming, cover it up. I guess they're aging, these books. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Nothing, this is so lame. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? How paranoid can you get? Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? 
He must really hate her. Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. Yes! Score! Boom! Precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. That does not look stable. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Let's see. The tools are stuck, out of reach, and no way in hell to get them. Brilliant, Max. Brilliant. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Man, I should have done that before they fell. Mad skills, Max. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Should I switch this on? Decisions, decisions. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Fingers. Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. It's like enough spam for a hundred years. So tranquil here, like a Japanese garden in Oregon. William used to grill awesome burgers for us. I wonder if he was the last one to use this. 
We made this grave for Chloe's kitty. Poor Bongo. He never saw that car coming. That took Chloe and me the whole day to draw. It's almost invisible now. What do you truly want to do when you grow up? Max, I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world, go far from here. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. I would be like Lara Croft, except real. That would be majorly cool. Totally. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us what to do. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love to be a photographer. As if I ever could be. What are you talking about? Max, you are a photographer. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. I believe in you. You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh... No way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. I was there hiding in the corner. Damn, you are a ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. That is so badass. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared too, I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question. Did you tell anybody? No, I didn't know what to do. I don't blame you. That's some intense shit. Maybe I should go to the principal. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Seriously, I didn't blab to anybody. Promise. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max.
I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday, but I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> This day couldn't get any stranger. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. Dude, the music's not even on! Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just. Let me in, now, please. One second, my bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Chloe, open this door. I'm giving you exactly three I'm not seconds. a kid anymore, I can't hide under the bed. One, Where else? Two, three. Shit. What's going on in here? Why is she here? None of your business. I don't like strangers here. Stop freaking! She's not a stranger! This is my friend! Great. Another one of your friends. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh god, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait! Is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth! That's an order. It's not my pot. It's from Max. Is this true? Uh, yeah. My pot. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do Get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know. You're not even a real cop. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Chloe? I'm coming! What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing! Give me a minute! This is going nowhere fast. I better look someplace else. Please. One second! I'm not a kid anymore. I can't hide under the bed. Where else? Soldier. Chloe, open this door. I'm giving you exactly three seconds to open the door. One, two, three. Shit. 
My no way, that's not mine. Oh, of course not. I'm sure Chloe gets all the best shit, right? I'm sure she gave you good friend rates. Why don't you get off my crack? Stop taking your war rage out on high school girls. You haven't seen rage, you little- Fuck you, pig! I- Listen. You asked for that. You know exactly what you're doing. I can already tell from today that you're trouble, Max. I hope this doesn't affect your status at Blackwell. Don't ever come back here. Listen, dipshit, if you ever lay a hand on me again, I'll have your ass in jail. Then you can guard yourself all night. You're the ones who'll end up in jail. Oh, you only think you're tough and clever. This too shall pass. And clean this pigsty up. I'm sorry, Chloe. I didn't know what to do. Whatever. Everybody bails on me. Even my best friend, Max. Don't you? So done with everybody in this town. I wish I hadn't even seen you. As if you care. Color me out of here. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? Chloe! I'm coming! What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing! Give me a minute! Don't get smart. Just let me in. Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing! Give me a minute! Don't get smart. Just let me in. Now. Please. One second! One second! My bra is stuck. I'm not screwing around, soldier. Chloe, open this door. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat will do that to you. Whose is it? Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon! Hey! Leave Joyce out of this! I wish you'd leave, Joyce! Like, now! Chloe, I'm sorry. I care about your mother, and you just keep pushing me. Don't touch me again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast! You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Hey, you okay? Welcome to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? He would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? I haven't been here in forever, so why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa, this is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today.
I got you. Hello, cute little squirrel. You and me, stare contest. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. Birds are so lucky, they can always escape. Oh my god, I forgot all about this. Too bad I can't rewind that far back. Wowzer, Chloe drew that to mark our tree fort, so we'd always be able to find each other in case of emergency. <sighs> Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. I never made it. How long has that been here? Those sure aren't big feet. What kind of animal left those prints? Weird. Those glyphs remind me of the wind. Clearly, the Bigfoots are everywhere. Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. Sure you don't want to be alone? Sit down if you want. Are you pissed at me? I just wanted some backup. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. I should have taken his photo when he flipped out on Kate today. That would be killer blackmail material. Let's bust his ass. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Uh, files? I know that look. You peeked. So, dish the dirt. Snuff videos? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. I worry there's spy cams in the house. I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it. He is so hella fucking paranoid. I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. No wonder I'm so miserable. 
Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put something in my beer. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. Chloe, that is so fucked up. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. What are you going to do? Pop a cap in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. Good thing you didn't tell anyone. Now I'm bringing the Walter White down on him. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. I'm like this in Oregon.
11? Is this Friday? That's only four days away. Oh no. The tornado is headed straight for the town. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. People don't have those powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. <gasps> what the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Yeah.